Sweeties, Black Metal Time here in Rauda once again. This time having a vinyl release of a band called Voodoo's. Now, previously I reviewed two other releases by Voodoo's and I have still uh, the debut album in my review queue. So it's going like in a peculiar order, all these releases, but it is what it is. And uh, this time we're going to focus on to an EP. Focusing the EP called Onto the Otherness, and this features MLP with some 25 minutes, roughly, give or take. EP with two tracks, so two lengthy tracks. Oh, sorry, open the otherness, obviously. I can't even say my my words here properly. And here you will find on this vinyl a lyric sheet which features these lyrics nicely laid out there, quite lengthy lyrics. Which then again, uh, it's quite all right considering that these tracks are over 10 minutes each. Four guys, and there is the basic information, and that's it. Now, I saw these guys more than a year ago in Finland when they were opening for uh, Mayhem and Gals Rude, and they played a nice, nice show there. And um, I like their previous releases as well, and I must say the band is able to do some interesting music. I really don't get what is going on with the review of 55% for the previous, uh, sorry, this album on, on Metal Archives, but I mean, it's their own. It's not like this kind of, you know, appeal to everybody, I guess that's the right way to say. And here you have the recording information with a barely readable font and track list and all that stuff. A shadow release records nice work with the EP. And as I was mentioning the Metal Archives uh, review here, I haven't even read it, so I have not, no comment on the words, just pay, paying attention to this rather low score, because in my opinion, this is definitely closer to this 80%, which the previous EP, Serpent uh, Seducer Savior, had. Now, Night Queen and Serpent Seducer uh, both were rather nice releases, and I think I have once listened to this into the wild um, full-length album when, when it came in Digipro and I was kind of waiting for the uh, album to come out and later on when it came, well, it fall in, fell into the queue to be uh, reviewed later on and this came as a surprise and because this is more recent, I had to review right now. And um, yeah, this seems to be once again a good release by Voodoo's with some two tracks, 13 and 11 minutes uh, and uh, I must say, um, this is kind of a hard cookie to tra crack or track. I mean, the thing here is, when you have these lengthy tracks, you are usually bound to get either bored or then it really requires sort of a higher degree of songwriting. And I'm still a little bit on the verge of uh, falling into either direction. That is, I think these tracks are kind of too lengthy. But then again, I don't feel it when I'm listening to these. Because what happens here is that the song are, songs are quite diverse. They could be actually individual tracks even, um, but they make sense. When you're listening to these, you kind of uh, get into this mood, this atmosphere, and you're just going down the road and you don't even realize that the clock is ticking so much. And then you're just like, okay, this is quite diverse in all. I mean, it has melodic parts, it has faster parts, it has slower parts. And it's kind of like atmospheric black metal, but not exactly. So it's kind of interesting because it has this level of aggression and also these melodic parts and also these kind of melancholic parts, but also these, well, more energetic parts. And they all kind of blend in nicely. It's just like you don't even realize where one part stops and the next one begins because it's just like a curvy road. You're just driving that road and you don't even notice that there are no crossroads or turns to left and right it's just getting into the mood kind of like when you get this runner's flow you know you just keep running and at some point you don't even realize you're exhaling and inhaling and that your legs are getting tired you just get into this mood well iron maiden made a great song about it but that's a different story now um given that this is not your typical release it makes so much sense that this is an EP release and not two tracks on a full length. I don't know if it would work that well in such a context, but here 
as individual EP, I think it makes a lot of sense. And as such, I think Voodoo's is definitely, once again, recommended by me uh, for you to check out. There is a link provided in the description box, so um, give it a go. It's something different from Sweden, yet at the same time have these kind of a similarities, which might feel good because you actually have this connection already made with them, even if you're a new timer to the music. So give it a go and I hope you enjoy it. Interesting release, but I guess as this review score points out, not for everybody. Anyway, I enjoyed it. I hope you will too. Take care.